Alright, so this is the video everybody's been waiting for. This is basically how I straighten my hair after I get done washing it, y'all. So as you can see, it's been in this um, ponytail that I braid, uh, usually because it's wet and it is still a little wet. Uh, I take it down, just kind of section it off, as you can see. Um, trying to get it to you know it's so much hair y'all so much hair so I gotta section it into different uh, sections to I guess limit the amount of hair I do at one time <laughs> um, so here we go so I personally do three sections I do two up top and then I do one at the bottom. So essentially, I'm um, trying to make it as quick as possible for me. Right now, I'm sectioning it so I can blow dry it. So this is actually a very long step process for me that I usually have to dedicate like two or three hours to. Well, if you think about it, three days because I don't do everything one night, but here I am just sectioning it off as you can see I have the two on the top right here and I just use those little red clips to you know make sure everything's secure and then now I have the bag that I'm just combing out making sure it's detangled you know this is my natural hair I don't have a relaxer in it now I'm about to use my Revlon blow, uh, blow dryer yeah, this blow dryer is so old. <laughs> Do not mind the fact that, you know, the letter's coming off. I, I've had this blow dryer since psh, 10th grade. So, yeah, I'm just blow drying. I usually start off with the bag, make sure everything is nice and dry before, you know, I get started, really, because this is like a, like, I wash it, I section it off. This is a, this is a long process, y'all, a very long process. Yes, the um, sections are a little lopsided. I don't take a comb and do it very well. I just kind of freestyle. So yeah, making sure everything's nice and dry. Uh, and I also oil my hair before um, I put in my ponytail to go to sleep. That way it's kind of just soaking in my hair overnight. blow dry it and make sure it's really dry I go ahead and braid it off so there's me braiding the back of it so I just repeat this step for my whole entire head you know the blow dry make sure everything's nice and dry um, while to get completely dry because I put on a low setting I don't want to burn my hair then I go into the braiding and make sure you know everything is braided off correctly that process yes I know I look like Felicia from Friday it is okay it is okay um, so this is what I use in my hair guys to oil my hair this is the only thing I use to oil my hair 
Yes, believe it or not. So now we are about to go into the flat ironing process. Yes, guys, this is a very long process. This is why I don't do my hair often. Now, generally, when I start flat ironing, I always start with the back. So I just unbraid it, you know, fluff it out, comb it out. And it's already, you know, super dry. So I'm sectioning it again, y'all my three sections turn into even more sections um, and I try to use you know the brush over method I think that's what it's called where you like you brush and you straighten it at the same time um, that's how like the little first strand pass over came out which is not too bad not too bad but you know I like my hair straight straight y'all straight straight so I just continuously go over it until I get it exactly where I want it, like so. And I just continue the process until I'm done with that particular section. So when that section turns into nothing, then I'm done. stuff works so good it, it can be used as a heat protectant as well because you know as you, i don't know if you saw on the label when you heat it up you can heat it up to 450 fahrenheit which is big my exact flat iron you know heat so it works perfectly fine uh, as you know a heat protectant so my hair doesn't burn but yep yeah, that's the finished product of the bag and two more sections to go as i dance it out y'all dance it out that's how i get through doing my hair because it takes so freaking long i have to just jam the whole time or i it wouldn't get done trust me on how I do my hair it takes a long time but I get really efficient results with it and I love it um, 
and you know I I just touched it up just a little bit add some curls here and there just to get my hair more body and I also do wrap my hair every single night y'all I faithfully wrap my hair for watching comment like subscribe bye